man. Let's wake up, little man. Using the logo of the Gator and the logo mark to match. That's a very good start. So this is the Civic logo. I love this one. It's a blue bow tie and his bright eyes. Oh, it's a side face today. And this is what it looks like. Oh, the eyes are caving in, but oh, I love it. It's beautiful. What do you think? Is it 10 out of 10? I give it a solid nine. Cedric, you can open the door. Thank you, Cedric. You're so strong. <laughs> it's the coffee. <laughs> Let's go outside in your new yellow coat. You ready to make the morning card into a little man? Let's go downstairs. Freshly clean, steady clean. Look at that. The walls are so straight. Gonna make the, the snow look the same color than his jacket. You're a painter, Cedric. Look at the amount of snow we have. It's like a huge mountain over there. Little snow facial surgery. No sun today, but look at these walls of snow for this little man. Which way are you gonna go, Cedric? He's going to his poop corner. You can't even see him, that's how high the snow is. That's why we wear bright colors. He's going to his favorite poop corner. It's a hike for him. A winter hike. Hopefully it doesn't get stuck in the snow again. You're coming back? You're no? Not there? You want to go where the bird feeders are? Change his mind. Oh, I think he wants to go back inside. Change his mind. Let's see if we can climb the stairs in this jacket. Cedric, good job, good job Cedric, you wanna go inside, is that cold, get the back, let's go in, have breakfast, after he eats his breakfast, then it's time to go on his pet bed. Cedric, we usually put a pet bed on the bed for him. Yeah. He likes this fluffy one right now. And there's a matching throw blanket for him too. Because sometimes he wants to be cozy and warm. So we throw it on him. And then he can make himself a little nest in it. Like this. This Place it around him and then he stays there till it's dinner time. What do we do? Cedric has a stomach ache today, so I was going to show you what I use for him to feel better after when he has a stomach ache. Preferably not a tea bag, but uh, some sort of a metal tea strainer or 
whatever you have. If you don't have, you can use a tea bag, but I don't recommend it. And here we have chamomile harvested from our own garden. I put like little photos of Cedric on it because it's his chamomile. But you can also get a store bought one. I recommend an organic chamomile. So you want a little bit of chamomile, not too much because uh, we're not going to fill the whole cup. We're going to just fill it just a little above the chamomile because he doesn't need a whole cup of tea. So about this amount is great for Cedric. And I also take a spoonful of honey. I think honey is good because he has a low blood sugar and when he has a stomach ache, he doesn't want to eat and his blood sugar levels go low and the stomach aches get even worse. And also it, there's some nutrients in there that's going to soothe him and help him to feel better sooner that also go really well with this uh, chamomile. What I do is I just take a little bit. It's good when it's um, liquid honey. I take like less than a spoonful, less than a teaspoon, less than even half a teaspoon. And I just put it on top here with the hot water. So as you can see, I don't fully fill the whole mug. I just fill just a little bit above the chamomile. And then I, the honey melts in it while pouring the hot water. And now I cover the, the mug. You can use a plate to cover the mug, but I have these uh, mug covers especially for tea and I'm gonna wait for about five minutes and I apply it with this syringe it's not a syringe it's like a dripper I don't know what it's called in English I think it's called a dripper it's a uh, for babies for applying medi medicine for babies but the same ones work for dogs too and I like this one better than a syringe because I can control the pressure far more easily on this one and just put like a few drops at a time on his tongue and he's uh, less nervous about that. So this is Cedric, he's having a stomach ache now and I wrap his face in the towel so it doesn't drip all over me because this is sticky from the honey and I'm just gonna gently put the bit in his tongue, see, and then I'm gonna keep on putting small amounts on his tongue to let him swallow. If something drips out, it's okay. We have a towel. It's okay, Cedric. And after that, you're going to let him rest a bit. He's going to rest for a while and hopefully feel better. Right now he has a tummy ache and he's not feeling good. Teddy had his nap now and he's feeling a lot better. And I don't think his tummy is aching anymore because he seems very relaxed and ready to have a nap and it doesn't look worried at all anymore and this is about an hour after I gave him the honey so I guess it worked well are you feeling better little man? he does now he needs to nap and feel better I'm gonna prepare his dinner and this is Cedric's dinner for tonight it's just plain boiled chicken with some carrots and a little bit of bean sprouts because um, his tummy wasn't feeling good so he's gonna have just a little bit of food and not too much and here he comes I think he's hungry 
You hungry, little man? You feeling better? Looks like he's feeling better. He's walking around. Where are you going, little man? It's Cox. He likes to splash. <laughs> so I have to draw it. Good night that he got for his birthday. Over here. This is good because this one is machine washable, so we can wash it. And it's bigger than his previous one, so he can have a lot of more room. He can have a lot more room to move around, do what he wants, eat. But instead, I feel like a sports commentator <laughs> instead of exercise. He eats and exercises all at once. That's why he's so tiny. He just burns all his calories. <laughs> I'm gonna let him eat in peace now. He's gonna have a lot of work to do and go back and forth. There he goes again. Said he finished his dinner and now he's back on the sofa for his nap. Well, I'm gonna watch some TV. We're gonna say bye to everyone. Right, Cedric? Can you say bye? See you next time.